Right, I'm going to show you how to fix the big balls up of uh, Sky. Now, when you do it, you'll notice that it's literally downloading a full software package and it reinstalls it on the TV. So this is showing that whatever Sky did, they completely ballsed it up and it's a reflash of the software inside the TV or inside your stream. So basically it puts your TV back to factory settings. Um, which is really shit because I do apologize for the language. I've just really had enough of this now. Um, so it means everything that you've logged into, you have to, when you first bought the TV, you have to do all over again. So there's not any way around this at all. Um, if you've had the problem, that is what you're going to have to do. So what you would have been greeted with is this little light that's down here flashing or not being on at all. So what you need to do, what I did, they said no need to unplug, but I have to with mine because I, it's inaccessible to get to the little flip. Right. Sorry about that. The video cut off. Don't know why. Um, I probably pressed a button. <laughs> um, so, yeah, you'll be greeted with the lovely um, no, no light at all or a, a, a slowly flashing red light. So what you need to do, like I just said a minute ago, um, I unplugged mine. Uh, it says you don't need to, but it was just easier for me to do that from the actual plug. Um, and then what I did around the side of the TV, oh, the button is just there down on the bottom of the TV. So you need to hold that button and then you plug your TV back, back in and you keep that button held until the little light down here starts flashing, but really flashing like uh, not just a slow pulsing, but really, really flashing. Let go of that. Um, it will take a little while to reboot, download all the software. You should see it all on the TV. You shouldn't really have any problems, but you might do. You've got to set it up. You've got to know your pin from when you first set the TV up. If you haven't changed it, it's simple. If you have changed it, you hope you remember what it is. It's the one that you'll put in if you're buying anything pay-per-view or if you watch... Um, like 18 content um, during the day or something you have to put it in um, and then you just set your tv up like it's a brand new tv absolute ball lake thank you sky for that you know we all absolutely love you for that absolute ball lake whoever caused this issue needs sacking needs booting out of the door no excuses there was no need for that or if it was a group of people same thing um, so on the, um, the uh, stream the little puck if you you can flick it off or just unplug it from the back, hold the button down, plug it back in and you wait until that LED flashes. I think it goes red, then orange, then green. Um, when it hits red, just let go of it. It'll be fine. And it just go into loads of different colors that boot up that do the same sort of thing. You've got to reset that back up as well, which is another ball ache. If you've got multiple devices that have um, had this issue, um, I'm feeling that it's probably older devices. Um, this is one of the very first sky glasses that actually came out of the factory and with the pucks who knows how long they've been lying around that is relatively new it's probably not even a year old but it could have been lying in a factory for a long time so thank you sky thank you for your absolute balls up in the nightmare for myself and lots and lots of other people that have had this stupid stupid issue that should never ever have happened but Thank you, lovely subscribers and all your comments. You know, we've got through it. I've got through it and hopefully you can get through it as well. Do exactly what I said and it should be OK. If not, just keep trying to phone um, Sky or contact. I, I, I probably wouldn't use a chat or any of the other ways because it's just terrible. Um, but try and phone them, get through a different way. Don't say it's a problem with your telly, say it's something else and then you'll get through to someone that thinks it's not going to be that. And then hopefully they'll transfer you to someone with the TV issues or the puck issues. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.